Hello and welcome to this video guide for 80s retro text effects Photoshop templates. So the pack contains some unique 80s retro synthwave or outrun themed Photoshop text effects which you can use in your next project be it CD cover, posters, flyers and so on. So let's dive into it and I'll show you how you can use them. So the pack contains different PSD files based on the different graphic styles you can simply double click on one of them to open it into Photoshop and the main text here is based on a smart object edit so it's over here it's highlighted in blue and it says place main text here you can simply double click on it and it will open a new smart object edit window where you can see the text there you can simply change your text and all you need to do is save the changes and close this file but make sure your text is in white for the effects to work correctly so there's a small info file over here as well and once you have saved your text here you just need to close this smart object edit window and your main text will be updated in the main file so here you can see the flares have been messed up a bit because these were based on the previous text all you need to do is go inside this flares folder which is highlighted in orange and there you can find different flares you can simply select one of them and let me zoom in a bit so that you can see clearly and you can select the move tool and you can drag the flares and adjust them accordingly also what you can do is you can select that appropriate flare layer and hit ctrl and t or command and t if you're on mac to bring up your free transform tool and with that you can rotate the flare or resize them and adjust them accordingly so let's quickly get them set into correct places and if you need extra flares you can simply right click and duplicate it to get some extra layers or if you don't need them you can simply hide them Okay, now you can expand this main text effects and here you can find this extrusion folder which you can expand and you will see different levels you can hide these levels and you can see that this will reduce the depth of the 3d effect also if you want you can play with the layer styles a bit you can right click on this main text smart object and select blending options and this will open the layer style window where you can play if you want to change the layer styles other than that if you want to change the subtext it's just a plain and simple text layer you can simply take your type tool and you can just click here to change the text effect just like that let's try it with another template so here is an outrun template and it's the very same here you can double click on this smart object edit window and go inside it to edit the main text Let's change it to something different. Let's save it. And we'll close it. And it will be updated in the main template file. As previously, we need to update these flares. And other than that, if you want to change the background elements, there is also a bit of customizability over there as well. You can get these different background layers where if you want, you can change the colors as well. Or if you want, you can play with the layer styles of these different background layers. So that should be all. You can find the download link to these template files in the description section. I hope you like it and if you want to check out more cool Photoshop actions and effects that I've created, you can check them out from the link in the description section. I'll see you soon and till then happy creating.